you know, I didn't mean to buy this box. This was an accident. Forgot to cancel it. We did buy the anniversary boxes begrudgingly. And uh, we're saving money for CreepyCon. So that's what you people should do. Save your money for cons and stop getting the s Who called that shit? Who fucking called that shit? I'm breaking the seal. We can go through this together. While we're doing that, let's talk about some of the so-called failures that we briefly mentioned last year that BAM did in our last video. We mentioned these failures. Remember the Dropbox? You remember when BAM let somebody else ship their stuff and it came in a fucking bag? You remember when they got away, when they did away with the props and you got stupid little cards that you could trade in and actually get a decent autograph? Do you remember when they were putting food in the anime boxes? Now, oh, there's nothing to indicate whether this is horror or geek. But if you watch other people's videos, you can tell that that first one was geek. So let's go ahead and start with horror. What a fucking surprise. Now look, I just want you to see how they put this in the box. You see that? Can you see the fucking bin? Hey, we're going to give you a fucking license plate. That uh, fucking frisbee. Sorry, girls. Yeah, I just threw that. Oh, it's okay, though. Don't make a big deal out of it. You can just flatten it out. Don't you like to get stuff that you got to fix? I kind of like, I kind of like the pen. Holy shit. That's, that's not a, uh, you can't see that fucking wrapper on it. Okay, let's hold it up. BAM! Isn't that what that guy fucking says? Oh, looks like we got a, no, we didn't. That, it's not limited. Who gives a fuck about that? I don't give a fuck about a broken prop. It's broke. That I gotta fix. And, oh wow, Linda Blair. If you just started collecting, get the anniversary boxes. I'll say that. If I got bad things to say about BAM, then I should probably have some good things to say too, right? If you just started collecting, you've been collecting maybe a year, year and a half, maybe two years, by all means, double down. Get the fucking anniversary box. Linda Blair, for this cost, is good. But I've already got Linda Blair. I've got Linda Blair on a Funko. I got Linda Blair on an awesome flat. And you know what? I've actually given away multiple fucking Linda Blair. So thanks for another one, Bam. I'll take a picture of this. Oh, wow. I just hold it up. You can see I don't even need to do that this time. So there's that. I guess you just need like a steady hand. Half. Dick. Anyways, let's go to the, uh, huh. and boy, did I fucking call it. Let's go to the fucking geek. Uh, is, yeah, it's Harry Potter. Sometimes the props are good. When they did the badges, like the Gotham badge, there's value to that. 
And guess what? I don't remember what the autograph was for that box, but chances are that prop is worth more than the fucking autograph that came in that box. Oh, I got the Modoc pin. The pins are good. Another art print. Boom! Not even going to show it to you. Just threw that motherfucker. And at least I didn't get the, um, the special one where you really, you couldn't see the fucking autograph. At least that you can see on the white. But, we already got his autograph on a Funko Pop at CreepyCon. So, I guess if I got to say something nice to Bam about this, uh, you know, I'm probably not going to pee on it like last year. Can we roll the footage of that? Cool. All right. Yeah. Um, and I guess I kind of like the fact that they put this in a box because it makes my Funko that has a quote on the side window worth more than your stupid fucking flat that if you were the lucky one, you can barely see. And I got the common dumbass art print. Yeah, I shouldn't have bought these. These were a waste of fucking money. Uh, the pins? Well, they were cool. I, bu I basically bought these for the fucking pins. And you say, where's that wrap-up video? Well, you know how hard it is to get all three of us together at the same time? It's not an easy thing. You try wrapping your mind around it just at home. And maybe you can give us another day or two to get that video out. But we wanted to get this out. <sighs> you know, we did end the video last year with me peeing on the BAM stuff. I wonder... wonder if there's going to be something special at the end of this one. Hey, you guys go see the new Ant-Man and the Wasp movie? It's a very exciting film where they go into the quantum realm where there are little pocket universes. And in one of those universes, you gotta wait for the post-credit scene. The post-post-credit, because it's after the main one. You gotta wait till the very end. You will see that there is a universe where when Half Geek said, Wait, this is the bane of my existence. I hate balls. She ran out into traffic. <laughs>